Tamam tamam hallettim hallettim. Yüzdeyliyim dedim yeter mi bence? Yüzdeyli yeter gibi ses söyleyin ona göre ayarlayın. Tamam indirdim. Bitince söyle. Evet. Yayına düşünce söyle indirmeyi. 25 kız. Şimdi. Şimdi. Okey. Tamamsak başlatacağım oyunu. Tamamız o zaman. En azından hikayeli oyun oynayalım bir daha şey olmaz ne bileyim. Hani e, sorun yaşamayız. 15 yıl bence. <gülüyor> o kadar mı? O kadar diğer çok geliyorsa yapalım. No problem. Şu an rahat mısınız? Rahatsanız ben başlatıyorum. Çünkü aksiyonda da artar bu ara. Bakalım. Oyunun olayını hiç bilmiyorum. Bir inceleyeceğim. Bir de şu kulaklığı yerden almak istiyorum. Bana da ses gelsin. Tişli seslerini falan duyamıyorum. Kulaklık takması aslında şöyle yapabiliriz. Ne de olsa kulaklığı bir kapanı kullanmıyorum. Bu sesini daha iyi duymak için. So I've done a full body cleanse on both of them. Space is sterile. Did you get blood samples for Kensington's research project? Mm -hmm. Nice work, Dr. Wakefield. So another drone? Yeah, they dropped nerve agent on their apartment block. A woman was coming home from the shops. The boy's playing with a soccer ball. What do you mean, uh, a football? Hi. I'm Amy. You're. Olmayan yani şu an konuşsanız da bir şey değişmeyecek. Pleasure to meet you, Dalva. Hikayeye odaklanalım. Are you gonna hurt me? Listen. Let me do my work, and you'll live. Arkadaşlar, tartışmayın. Şu an oyun oynamıyor ekranda. Ne oynuyor? Sonra konuşalım lütfen. Rica edin. Reese, I need to administer atropine. Yeah, I, I didn't get a chance to restart the vials. Supply tent now. It's okay. It's okay. Atropine injections work for everyone I treated in Syria. Okay. You're all right. You're all right. What's your name? Dima. We're not safe here. The Supreme Leader ordered this attack. We're here to help you. He's trying to kill us. Both of us will stand against him. Tell me. We're just gonna ruin my life. Tata. It's very serious. We are in the best possible hands, I promise. Honesty. It's very nice to hear it for once. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The supply tent's been depleted. There's only one pile left. What are you gonna do? Make a decision. Dima, give me your arm. Dima, please, you have to trust me. This will save you and your baby.
Koronanın ipini değil mi? Tam olarak o değil mi? Reese, how do I save them both? Reese nerede gitti? Reese nerede gitti? Ne oluyor be? Bu daha ilk baştan ortalık karıştı. Şu an çekilmiyor da ben artık nasıl izliyorum. We stand on the precipice of history. I'm Dr. Amy Tennant, and I'm here on behalf of the visionary Natalie Kensington to inform you how your investments have made that possible. Firstly, we've been using your billions for the greater good. The Kensington Corporation's relationship with Ken. Seye bastığımda kararlarımın nasıl etkilediğini karakteri görebiliyormuşuz buradan. Okay, devam edelim has flourished since the resolution of its civil war. Our teams have been working on development projects with some of the country's top scientists. Natalie has even developed an internship program for some of the country's brightest young minds. In fact, some of our Kindarian interns are here with us today. Oh, hey. Is Kindar still a totalitarian state? Human rights violations and all that shit? Kindar is at peace. Moving on, the Kensington Corporation is dedicated to bringing hope and new technology to. It's bad PR for us to associate with Kensington if she's dealing with a dictator. We're all here to discuss the amazing. Answer my fucking question. Ah, harakete bak. Why has Natalie sent a nurse to tell us anything anyhow? Actually, I'm a doctor. You know who I am, right? May I ask you to leave the boardroom, please, sir? Okay. Yeah. I'm pulling my funding. Check. Salak düşüyordu. Babasının parasıyla hava atan tipler olur ya. Aynı olur değil mi adam? Free champagne. Fedava şampanya verince böyle oluyor. Kadının yalnız gidişatı hiç şey değil. Ölecek mi ama? Tamam. Korumanın ilk belirtilerini verirken ben temsil değil mi? Now, the real reason you're here. The Kensington Complex. Ve farkındaysam... Our impenetrable HQ of laboratories built bespoke to Natalie's specifications by the world-renowned Parker Kaplani. Deep within the complex is Security Lab Alpha, a womb of scientific advancement. There, we have something remarkable in development. I'm sure all of your news feeds have told you that Gordon Grosvenor's expedition to Mars is becoming a reality. Yes, the first person to set foot on Mars will be British if we can hurdle this final obstacle together. Hey, are you okay? Yeah, rough night. Don't do drugs, Kay. We can't fit a hospital on a 10-ton Mars lander. How do we get around this? Nanocells. Stem cells interwoven with nanotech. Once inside a host, they migrate to the site of injury. There, they regrow bone and generate extra blood to help catalyze the healing process. Tiny magic bullets. <laughs> <laughs> What's your problem? <sighs> this uh -oh. is, of course, just a mock-up. The real nanocells are still in development and securely back at the complex, but once they're ready, we can begin it's regulated human to... trials. Having treated victims no, no, of chemical you. attacks all over the world, I know that nanocells could be miracle tech. Amy, you'll need 
it urgently. Hang on. I have some serious concerns about this. Likewise. Before my employer invests any more capital, she wants some answers. Amy, it really can't wait. We need to get you to the car now. Yes, absolutely. What are your questions? What's the catch of this miracle tech? You've made it in a lab, so is it radioactive or what? What about privacy laws? Are they trackable? Don't worry, okay. we're talking about genetic reprogramming here, so nothing artificial or unnatural would ever go into our consumers' bodies. Amy, please, we need you now. It's an emergency. I have to go, but please stay and enjoy the wonderful hospitality. Let's go, Emily. We need to get you oh, the scene of the the scene. Yeah. What happened? It's already gone viral. I'm ruling out food poisoning. She has other alarming symptoms, we've been told. Naturally, everyone's crying terrorism. A suicide bomber with a malfunctioning bioweapon? We need to get her to the complex. Okay, why is this our problem? Because she's one of our interns. Thank God you're here. This is beyond our remit. Oh. Excellent quarantine work. I'll examine her back at the complex. Yeah, we were waiting on your word before moving her. A single person drone or ground ambulance. The drone will get her there faster. But it's more dangerous. If it crashes, then whatever's inside her, it gets out into the public. It won't crash. It's Kensington Tech. Use the drone, Amy. Drone. Don't fuck it up. So, what else do we know about her? Nothing yet. Let's get back to the complex. Okay. Okay. Okay. Okay. Well, the prospect of losing a friend in a strange country, I can empathise with that. Today we need all your field experience, Amy. Time to roll back the ears. Mm -hmm. You can say that again. You've got to be kidding me. Nah. It's been a while, Dr. Wakefield. You got here fast. Well, there weren't any blood vomiting ladies on the job. Kız, Miss Wakefield. Anlatabiliyor muyum? Kız kültürlü. Sen nerelisin? Let's walk and talk. Herkesi tanıyorum mu? Tanıyorum mu? Hoş geldin. Takipin için teşekkür ederim. Merhaba. So, which legend fed the media the anthrax rumor? I need to take this. Was it her? So, do we have a name yet? Claire Mahek. She's one of us. Inside job. Now, she must be acting alone. Why else would she take the tube? Well, Uber doesn't offer a getaway car service yet, so... <laughs> Look, if we consider the hysteria, might actually be valid. What, terrorism? I highly doubt it. Perceptive as ever. Hey, Amy, look. I promise, I didn't know you still worked here. If I did, I would have... Stayed away? Yeah, I'm sure. Look. Why are you skydiving? Or bungee jumping, or whatever it is that you were up to. Because I'm passing through London. I checked my Twitter feed this morning, saw something I could help with. Plus, Kensington wants my expertise again. Well, she already has my expertise. I'm not disputing that, nor am I apologising for the skydiving. Guy's got to live. <sighs> and then if you can come back and let me know your decisions. OK, thank you. You didn't want to run this by me? 
Two lifesavers are better than one. Reese Wakefield is a deserter. I know he's let us down in the past, but people change. Emily did due diligence too. Come on. Hey, uh, guys, can I just, uh, have five minutes? Just, uh, just need to use the gents. Can we go, please? Merak ettim nereye gideceğini bu arada. Ne şey karıştırıyor as well. There are toilets down there. Amy. <gülüyor> Bir halt karıştırıyor gibi bu adam farkındasınız değil mi? Oyun güzel bu arada. Natasha tarzında yine. Zaten onun önerilerin önerilenlerinde gördüm birazcık ama ben bu tarz oyunlar oynamam. Gender istedim. fluid toilets. New policy. Ama adamın bu kadar takip edeceğini düşünmemiştim bu ara. <gülüyor> Yine ne kadar güzel tuvalete kadar gideceğini düşünmemiştim. Ne yapıyor bu? Şimdi adam ne yaptı? Anlayan var mı? Ben anlamadım da şahsen. Premier Assistant Stanley Security yani. Lab Alpha. You should see the other guy. Espri mi yapıyorsun gerçekten? Security Lab Alpha. Sanki bir şey canı sıkılmış gibi ya da zoruna gitmiş gibiydi. Ne is this my tech? Ne de bilemedim. Yes. How? I mean, nothing leaves or enters the lab without us knowing about it. Emily and I will get to the bottom of that. You just get the <gülüyor> nano cells, otherwise our life's work's gone. Çok merak ettim şu an. All of the nano cells are inside of her. It, it was a master batch. No duplicates were made. Sanki kızana habersiz bir şeyler çeviriyorlar gibi. Zaten baş karakteri sevdiği belli ya. Çok bariz ortada da. Oh my god, you guys are serious about your fashion. Yeah, no more frumpy hazmat suits. Pressure suits? You'll see. All right. This feel personal, Claire. Of course. Well, she was in excruciating pain, and she stumbled all the way to the tube station. Feels more emotional than just following orders. Bu adam iki kişiyi kurtarmaya çalışırken kaç adam değil mi yetmişti? Evet. Sanki o yalnız o ilerden bir sahne de olabilir. Bunu da unutmayalım. Geçmiş değil de ileriden belki. We're going into space. Pushed on the Vacuum conditions active. Something like that. Echo! This vacuum acts as the last line of defense to prevent microbes from escaping the lab. Hmm. The lack of air makes it sterile as hell. Well, it's great on a microscopic level, but it could do with some physical barriers. How long have you worked here again? Acıdım bir tık. Bir tık acıdım. You know, it wasn't just Bize... skydiving. You know, I needed a Bence de bir şey var ama... reset. Try new things. Bir şey dönüyor ya.
So the meditation's new. So is the spying. Adam çok iyi gözüken insanlar da kötü çıkabiliyor bak bunu da unutmayalım. Ben de o yüzden pek emin olamıyorum. Dr. Thomas Malkin, Dr. Everly North. This is Dr. Reese Wakefield. He'll be assisting us today. Cool pony cell. Let me take you to her. <sighs> Feels like we're at the center of those dolls that go inside each other. Matryoshka dolls. Yeah, Russian, aren't they? So what's your story then, Malkin? I wanted to assist Dr. Tennant since I saw a talk at the Plains Summit about the extracellular matrix and lattice in stem cells. Hmm. But this is really like a girl's hair. Holy shit! It's actually a bald structure. We've never seen anything like it. I have a sample of her blood under the microscope. Saçını bırakıp gitmiş mi? Öyle bir şey var gibi böyle. Bak baya ters davranıyor çünkü kız. Aşırı da öyle. Guys, this is my tech. The nanocells are inside her. But they're unfinished. There's no off switch, so they're just coursing through her body, producing excess bone and blood. But how could she have contracted them? From a spillage, maybe. They barely survive for two minutes once they're exposed to air, and she didn't have the authorization to access them. Someone's put them in her. <laughs> No, no, no, no, leave it in, Claire. You need it. Mm, feels fucking weird. You a terrorist? <sighs> be a <laughs> terrible one if I was. <laughs> I did this for Mina. What's Mina? Terrorist organization. Oh, will you stop that, please? Look, how many times have we seen a lone wolf release pathogens into the air? Nanocells aren't airborne. They can only be transferred via blood-to-blood -blood yeah. contact. Answer call. Named as Claire Mahek, a Kendarian intern at Kensington. TV off. Tell me you can retrieve our nanocells. Not directly. We'd need to extract a large blood sample to keep them active. From there, I'll use that as a roadmap to recreate the master batch. Seems simple enough. enough. She has plenty of blood to spare. Not exactly. Her new bone matter is consuming her body's resources at an accelerated rate. If I remove that much blood in one go, she'll die. And if she dies before you extract her blood? Without a living host, the nanocells will just dissipate. Au revoir, nanocells. So either way, she dies. OK. Amy, we're going to have to go for the option where we retain our asset. Natalie, I can't just. I'll get back to you. Hareketlere bak. Emir veriyor bir de. What should we do, Resmen doctor? Resmen öldür dedi. Set up for a full blood diagnostic. There has to be a way to get the nanocells out of her safely. Dr. Wakefield, please replace her IV. I can't risk any outside contamination. Sure thing. Dr. Tennant. Replace this, okay? Don't bite me. Can you sort my dad again? Whoa! Hang on, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Who delivered this crate? I see when we arrived this morning. Well, it's in the way. It needs to be moved.
Dr. Malkin, can you move this crate for me, please? Sure thing. Thank you. Ooh, no. Dr. North. Dr. North. I'm sorry, my shoulder's playing up. Do you mind? Cheers. Adamın kolunda ne var? Oh my God. Ne oldu be? Dr. Noy? I knew there was something off about Malkin. What kind of a scientist has a fucking ponytail? Tim, it will be. Yeah. It's clear, all right. I'm currently the safest person in this room. Yeah. Good enough for me. Why are we in lockdown mode? It's detecting the poison from the acid bomb. It won't be in the air for much longer. Thanks for that. Call Natalie Kensington. Emily, where's Natalie? There's been an incident in the lab. Yeah, I can see that, and the biosecurity's kicked in. I need Natalie on the line right now. I don't care who she's with. Yeah, okay, she's in her office. I'll call you right back. And call. First things first, let's get this cleaned up. Okay, ready? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh. We'll be back in a minute, Claire. Don't go anywhere. Yeah, when they jump in the car, boom, boom, boom. Kadın farkında değil herhalde. Şeyin içinde gücün. Don't mistake it. Well, that needs to come out one way or another. Kensington could have at least left us some of the expensive whiskey. Ah. Uh, well, this is gonna stink. What does the sign say on an out of the bottle? Huh? Ah! Ah! Oh! Beat it. We're close. Fuck off. It's so good. I'm just going to park it. Hey, the game is on. I'm sure I'm going to Clean this wound. No, no, no, it'll be fine. We've got bigger fish to fry. Did you hear that? Yeah. What was that? What did you say? Wait here. I'm going to go see if there's something in the intensive lab. No, Amy, it's fine. Look, we need to figure out what the fuck is going on. Bence en güvenli oda burası herhalde. Açamam da bunu. Umarım. Umarım ölmeyiz bu arada. Hello? Hello? Can anyone hear me? Amy? Seyir kim ya? Hang tight Claire. Ölüyor mu o? Gerçekten ölüyor mu? 
Umarım ölmüyordur. Yani. Çok bencilce <gülüyor> ilerliyorum ama hadi hayırlısı. Bakayım. Yok ölmedi daha. Daha ölmedi tamam sıkıntı yok. It's just like Yemen. Yemen. <gülüyor> Yemen'de ne geçti aramızda? Şunların arasında ne olduğunu aşırı merak ediyorum bu arada. Salim? No. That came from the void. İçtik. Sanki bir şeyler veriyor ama ne olduğunu da anlayamadım ben hiç. Anlayan var mı aramızda? What the hell is that? It must be coming from beyond the walls. There's only security cameras we can check. On the computer, but I don't know how my assistant did that. Ah, right, would you mind? Thank you. Ah. Thank you, sir. Glad These are the security cameras in the void. Cavalry? In masks? What's the rumbling though? Sound doesn't travel in a vacuum. Shit, they've mm -hmm. deactivated the vacuum. No prizes for guessing who the brains of this operation is. God bless our security walls, eh? Oh, dog. Güvenlik duvarlarında kırdılar bu ara. Silahlarla geliyorlar üzerimize. This is impossible. They would need unprecedented access to our security systems to be doing this. They're her dumb cavalry. Look, they're Kandarian too. I knew you were part of something bigger. Bump us all together because they have the same features. Big eyes and big lips too. The divisions in my country are complex. Those bunch are not from my team. And now they're fucking with us. Answer call. Are you on the phone? You've been infiltrated to Kensington. Dr. Malkin was a plant. Thanks to him, Dr. North is dead, and so are my dreams of becoming a professional footballer. But you killed Malkin. Yeah, how'd you know that? Emily checked security footage from the lab. I mean, does privacy even exist around here? There are three mass intruders in the void, and they're armed. They deactivated the vacuum and bypassed the security wall. I'm still alive. Make sure she knows that. Biosecurity is still enabled, so you are safe no matter what. Please. Well, unless they open the door with that magic laptop. I'll get onto this intruder situation. Oh, well, not that I'm not grateful, but why is lockdown mode still active? The poison from the acid bomb has dissipated and the bioprotector is containing Claire's infection. It must be detecting something else. The safety of London is paramount. We can't risk a bug getting into the city. Amy, you need to extract Claire's blood, especially if the intruders have come for her. The nanocells cannot fall into the wrong hands. Well, there's uh, an easy way to prevent that. We smoke Claire. No! End call. Wow. Still can't keep your cool under pressure. She's responsible for this. That makes no sense. We're her only hope at retrieving the nanocells. Yeah, she's going to let us extract the nanocells and then kill us by gunfire. Wow. Leak much? All right, look, Parker Kaplani designed this lab, right? Do you think he built an escape route, a back door, anything? I don't know. We'd have to ask him ourselves. What now, Claire? Can we move the dead people? Elleri kaldırır mısın? Mantıklı. Bu ara gerçekten çok mantıklı bir şey. She mentions it. Okay, how about this one? A 
enough with mm. the Natalie theories. Remember those new skills I was telling you about? Well, advanced computing is one of them. Programming, coding. Hacking. I prefer the term unsolicited browsing. Yeah, no, sorry. Hacking is better. Look, I know you two are besties, but I find that a little bit... Yeah. Let's access her camera. Give her a little listen. This is how scientists get killed, you know. Where did you learn to do this? If I told you, I'd have to kill you. You ready? Wait, you shouldn't... Look, if she's got nothing to hide, what's this year? We're in this together. We need to cooperate if we're going to survive. Go ahead. They're on. The three intruders in the void have managed to lock every lift and door giving us access down there. Whatever they've done is caused electrical blips throughout the entire building. There are questions. Have the security idiots announced an upgrade gone awry? No one can think this clear situation is any more serious than it already is. This seems planned, Natalie. There must be more traitors in our midst. Emily, please. The Two problem. people are trapped in that lab with our prized asset. They are our priority. Announce a security upgrade. I clear the airways in case she calls. Who could the traitors be working for? That's the original. Claire. Amy. What do you and your friends want? I'm not an espionage mastermind. They aren't with me. So how did all the nanocells end up inside you? Is it not totally obvious? You should listen to Professor Xavier over there. About what? Kensington. So she put them in you? <laughs> no. <laughs> Not me. Can I call you? Have you been at the complex? A year. We've always had passing conversations on higher floors, but I don't think you remember. I always wanted to work in this lab with you. No, sir. Well, here we are. Claire, come on. Just tell me what's happening so that I can help you. Who's Mina? Mina Kim, yeah. Claire. She was about as useful as a chocolate teapot. Ready for more cryptic bullshit? Answer call. Guys, you were right about the intruders. They've sabotaged the system and have electronically barricaded themselves in the void. Yeah. Tell us something we don't know, please. How are they bypassing our security system so easily? Kensington Corporation's dark plummets admit to links off. to... Rescue plans are being made. Well, have you contacted Parker Kaplani? He designed the lab. He'll know how to get us out of here. We've been trying, but he could be anywhere on the planet right now. Parker has no compunctions about who he builds labs for, as long as he pays court. Excuse me. Where did it go? Emily, wait, please, give us something, help us. Dr. Malkin, the three intruders in the void, Claire, they all infiltrated the complex expertly. What, another country in the space race, or? Possibly, well, they might be trying to steal the nanocells or destroy them. 
Herhalde bir şeyler. I'm going to move heaven and earth to try and get hold of Parker. Thank you, Emily. And call. Whatever they're doing up there, we need to come up with some ideas of our own. <sighs> Is there anything else you can do in the computer system? I can hack the communication lines, get in touch with Parker Kaplan and myself. Okay, awesome. You do that. I'm going to look for a way out of here. <coughs> Are you okay? Yeah. I think the air is getting stale down here. No, that's impossible. Even in lockdown mode, there's always a steady supply of oxygen. Lost something? Welcome back, Sleeping Beauty. I need something to get me past that vent cover. I always wished I was taller. Hep tamızın olmak istemişim. Hey mate, do you need a hand? Yeah. See, even with one leg, Wakefield is the MVP. Most vanishing person? Ooh. No, harsh. no, no, no, I'm proud you've grown some wet. Come on. Okay. That's it. <laughs> Do it. How you doing? Good, yeah. No? Is it? Loosen up. Yeah. Nice work, Tenant. Okay. Let's take the video. Go. <laughs> Going in or not? Okay. Ready? Yeah, that's three. One, two, three. How was under my daddy? Name is the guy. Shake it. Sapuz, lan, biz. Maya, biz. Dedim miyiz de how was under my daddy? Name is. Bence kafayı yemiş falan olmuyor. Bu ara hayatta böyle bir şey yapmam. Bunu da net bir şekilde söyleyeyim. Bu ne be? Freeze. The vent continues behind the oxygen tank. Can you squeeze past it? Only one way to find out. Tankin no, bence riskli orada bir şey var ama. Oy. Gaz akışını da yapmazsın bu arada ya. Yaktık galiba. Yanıyoruz. Yanıyoruz. Made it. That's excellent news. I thought you were going to get stuck. <gülüyor> I think there's something further on. Şimdi <gülüyor> dedim bir an var ya bir taşın yani. <gülüyor> Elimizi kestik. Çok güzel. Bir böyle. Bir şey sorabilir miyim? Buraya kim girdi? Bunları kim kırdı? Bir düşünsene bir. Kanı falan bırak da buraya kim girdi? Önemli olan şey bu bence. Baksana. Quite cute, matching wounds. I mean, mine is yeah, mine mine slightly more impressive. Mine put both of yours to shame. I hate her. 
So, anything else of note up there? Just a storeroom full of broken glass and... Steel. There's only one wall left between them and the lab door. Please tell me you got hold of Parker. Negative. Uh, I got hold of the CCTV footage from the past 24 hours. Okay. Sift through it. Bak bu gezermiş kutuyu. Fucking sneaky bastard. <gülüyor> 